Also, the House of Representatives has urged the Federal Ministry of Education to commence a pilot program in selected schools across various states to assess the feasibility and benefits of utilizing local languages as a medium of teaching. This directive is sequel to a motion entitled Promoting Local Languages as a Medium of Instruction in Primary and Junior Secondary Schools in Nigeria, raised during plenary by Honorable Paul. It noted that Nigeria boasts of an extraordinary linguistic diversity reflecting the rich cultural tapestry of the nation and stating that teaching in one's mother tongue often leads to stronger teacher-student connections as it creates a conducive learning environment and positive classroom dynamics. Aware that the use of local language will lead to strengthening the lead teacher students connectivity. Also aware that promoting the use of our local language in our teaching instruction will also enhance the mother tongue, which of course is going into extinction. Further aware that engaging in the local communities in education, especially in the process, will encourage the community participation in teaching and learning. The House adopted the motion without debate and mandated its Committee on Basic Education and Services and Legislative Compliance to ensure compliance and report within four weeks for further legislative action. Also at plenary, the House passed for second reading a bill for an act to repeal the Minister of Finance Incorporated Act 2004 and enact the Minister of Finance Incorporated. The bill was sponsored by Honorable Ademorin Kuye, member representing Shomolu Federal Constituency in Lagos State. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.